It's a DNA. Yeah. And uh, she, she wanted to beat me, which I like. <laughs> because of the market of today, her creation business is not growing up properly. She had to design, not like me. She had to design clothing for young people. So naturally, she changed her target. Uh, a, a bit punk, a bit girlish. Sometimes I feel, yeah, oh, oh, it's me. Painful. Yeah? Yeah, because uh, the time is different. Mm -hmm. when, when I started fashion, it was a moment Fashion was most strongest, st stronger than any culture. So we were we were lucky. Yeah. But now, fashion market became very flat. So uh, real creative clothing has no space. So uh, she's struggling about that. I feel a bit sad for her. seems like they have no space in the market. But, but, I feel some kind of new wind s started uh, blowing because the people started uh, tired of cheap fashion. So, uh, I want to tell to young student, young designer, be patient. Time will come. I found uh, two types of uh, young, young designers. One type is uh, thinking how to, how to get in the world. The other type is don't know what's going on in, in, in the world, and very innocent. And I prefer innocent. Ah, yes. Yeah. Because uh, if you think too much about today's market, you, you cannot move. Mm -mm. You cannot continue. Mm -mm. So uh, I prefer uh, so-called natural-born creator who doesn't know about market, they, they, they only want to create something else without thinking. I like it. 